Well, we've talked about it ad nauseum on our show. What's that? The elusive four-day work week. Oh, God. Yes, I want it so bad. Because we've been begging, begging management for it. I mean, most people don't have it. And we've had a few people text into 78592, though, that say, I have a four-day work week, and I love it. If you all switch to four-day work weeks, then we could follow. Because we follow your, like, work schedule in the morning. Yes, blame the listeners. Good idea. We need everyone to do it. Everyone needs to be on board. (laughs) Yes. But for most people, the four-day work week is just something that's not in the cards. But Chick-fil-A is actually trying to top that. They said four-day work week. (laughs) Ha! How about a three-day work week? Whoa, what? let's slow down. Three days? What the heck? How the hell are you only work at, I mean, like, yeah, even I, I think you need yeah. to more than three days. Now I'm like, wait a minute. Well, they're actually testing it right now in Miami. Is that just so that they don't have to pay anybody full-time benefits? <laughs> Workers are doing 13 to 14-hour shifts. Oh, my God. A day, God. which I'll, I'll admit doesn't sound all that great. No. That sounds it's, terrible. You would need three days to recover from that. You get more than three days. You get four True. whole days off to recover after it. So you're a zombie for two of them, and then the other two, you're cool? The benefits, though, are pretty cool because it helps you with your child care planning and scheduling for other gigs or just having more free time to do whatever you need to do in a know. four days off. I don't know how it helps with child care. You literally don't see your kid for three days. <laughs> work that's for the that same long. as you are now. No. <laughs> <laughs> how does that well, you help? You do that by choice. They've been trying this out <laughs> since February, and 400 applications came flooding in. And if you can believe this, they got a 100% retention rate. Really? Oh, People wow. like it. Nobody wow. is leaving. Nobody is quitting. They love the three-day work hey, week. Hey, you guys, wow. you want to Why don't we just do 18 hours of a morning show every day for two days, and then we can huh. only have a two-day work week? <laughs> I mean, at that point, we're basically a podcast, one show a week. Well, we are yeah, that yeah. as well. Yeah, we <laughs> yeah. also have a podcast, actually. Yeah, well, now it sounds like more work. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> anyway. I'm just against it. Yeah, let's stop talking about it and just move on to the shot caller question of the day. Okay. Send it to the one person who does an eight-day work week, Digital oh. Jake. Oh. He's Impressive. A hard the hardest working person on the show. Jake, what are we doing? Well, we're fresh off Halloween, which Brooke will tell you through her chocolate-stained dentures, is one of the most <laughs> beloved and cherished holidays of the entire you year. You are coming at me hard today. My gosh. She does love <laughs> Halloween. But there are certain events that come up on the calendar she isn't quite as fond of. And I'm not just talking about her wedding anniversary. Oh, uh, see, just one more. On. One for the road. One for the road. It's not what okay the for the road. <laughs> that was a disaster, the 10-year anniversary. It was. That's not because I wasn't looking forward to it. It just turned out terrible. Anyway, a new survey asked 1,000 people to name the official and unofficial holidays that people hate the most. Oh, mm. interesting. I have the top four responses, and you'll each need to give me one of those answers in a classic flavored edition of Unglued Family Feud. The last person standing will get shocked, and leading off is the man whose favorite holiday is Dio de No Pantalones, Young Ah. Jeffrey. (laughs) Jefe, tell me an unofficial or official holiday that people hate. Uh, Okay, well... Maybe this is unpopular opinion, what? but I think everybody secretly hates one holiday, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and I'm not saying this just because I'm Jewish, but I think deep down, a lot of people hate Christmas. Dude, I uh... actually was thinking that. See, I thought for sure your mommy issues were going to come through, and you are going to say Mother's Day. No, I, everybody <laughs> loves Mother's Day, but I think a lot of people are really anti-Christmas. Just because uh, of the expectation and how much work money. it costs. Yeah, I mean, the hectic gift buying, the travel, yeah. the decorations, yeah. having to spend time with your relatives. Dude, the music. Some well, people hate Christmas music. And it's basically, it's not just a day anymore. It's a four-month-long yeah. celebration <laughs> that you're like, I can't wait till this is Bro, over. this yeah. makes a lot of sense. Yeah. So, I'm going to go with... Uh, I'm going to guess Christmas? I'm going to guess... <laughs> Christmas is a secret hated holiday. Mm. Christmas is not on the list of hated holidays that I have in front of me. Should have done Monica. Let's go over to Uh, Alexis. (laughs) Okay, Kanye. (laughs) That's not what I meant. Okay, now that was over the line. Yeah. (laughs) Christmas isn't on the list. Let's head over to Alexis. (laughs) You're terrible. That was hilarious. I 
think, okay, well, obviously, people who aren't celebrating it hate Valentine's Day. But you hate it because you have FOMO, not because you don't want to celebrate it. But I think the people who do it don't really like it that much either. I mean, you have to get a gift. Mm -hmm. I'll say my husband and I trade off every other year because it's such a pain. It is, and everywhere's busy. Like, dates are cute or not on that day. I just feel like. Do it. I don't know. I think Valentine's Day, Jake. Good answer. Valentine's Day is the number one answer on the list. Yeah. Yeah. A good okay. one. Overrated. Number one is off the board. We're back oh, to Jose. Shoot. Unofficial right. or unofficial holiday that people hate. So because people are jumpy and they don't know what's going to happen, April Fool's Day. Oh, no, I didn't. Tons uh, of pranks yeah, happening all throughout the day. That's you never know what to expect. But we don't get the day off, Jake. I'm going to say April. April. <laughs> <laughs> April Fool's Day. April Fool's Day is number two oh, yeah. on my list. Hey. Okay. Jose is safe. Brooke and Jeffrey are I left. I think I have the final one. Okay. okay. Oh, it is, is the it? biggest disappointment night of the entire year. You Every year. Valentine's Day. No. Nope. <laughs> New Year's Eve. Yeah, Show me New I Year's Eve. That. All hype, lame oh. parties. New Year's oh. Eve. Oh. Not what? on the list. New Year's Eve is great. Awesome. I was kind of with no. you. The hangover Dude, sucks. it's yeah. always been overrated. Really? I always have all these high expectations and then. <sighs> I've got this, though. Okay? Okay. Thanksgiving is great. Yeah. The day after Thanksgiving, oh, Black, Black Friday. Friday oh. Horrible. Oh, oh that's good. It's that's, that's good. good. And it's not like it used to be now. Like people really judge you hard if you leave Thanksgiving early to yeah. go like stand outside of a Target for a few yeah, hours. We gotta go put your like, at Best Buy. Well it's just like get online. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so I'm going with Black Friday. Good hated answer. holiday. Black Friday is number four oh. on the list. Oh. I was going to say Boxing Day next. Let's go over those top <laughs> answers of unofficial holidays that people hate. Number one was Valentine's Day. Alexis got that. Jose said April Fool's Day at number two. Yes. Number three was unsaid. It was Columbus Day. All right. So wow. Brooke's going to be taking the shock today. And somebody wanted to hear Holiday by Green Day. I beg to dream and differ from oh. the hollow light. Oh. This is the dawning of the rest. <laughs> Brooke God. jumped up like four feet from her seat when she got shocked that time. I, I got beat down in the last six <laughs> yeah. minutes. Brooke, we all love you. Oh. Yeah, every day is a holiday with you, Brooke. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> right. Candy hangover. That's your shot collar question of the day. Your phone tap's coming up in just a few minutes. Just <laughs> to